First, though, a Central Florida school district moves one step closer to changing its search policy. School leaders in Volusia County say searches without cause will save lives. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Austin. And I'm Ginger Gatz. And tonight they hammered out the wording of the proposed policy. News 6's Treasurer Roberts is in Volusia County tonight. Volusia County School Board took the next step toward doing school searches in the district. They voted tonight to advertise the policy before they make a final vote. All those in favor, please say aye. 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 Any opposed? Nay. All right. It passes four to one. After a brief discussion by the Volusia County School Board, they've decided to move forward with the language of the school search policy. It reads, all individuals entering or present on Volusia County school sites or events are on notice that randomized screenings may be conducted without cause by the site administrator utilizing minimally intrusive electronic devices. Not everyone was on board with this language, though. I want to support this policy. I just, I really don't like that verbiage. That's my take. The school board council explained why the language was written this way. The reason for a search without probable cause or reasonable suspicion required that we include random and without cause. That was that's the whole point of the random search language. According to the district, the random searches they're proposing don't refer to students being randomly selected for searches. The schools will be randomly selected. The district said they would use a computer generator to randomly pick a school, then bring metal detectors to that school and set them up in front of a classroom. The classroom would also be chosen randomly. To minimize the disruption of instructional time, this would take place at the very beginning or end of the period. I want the screenings done. <clears throat> if we can catch any student coming on campus or an adult and they have a weapon with them. The policy language will be advertised for 28 days and they'll come back on May 14th for that final vote. In Volusia County, Treasure Roberts getting results, New 6.